I hate YouTube, so uh, I'm going to do um, some hauling today with the uh, recon. I think y'all can see it. There you go. But, uh, so, I'm going I'm to say it was like September or October of last year. I was cleaning out our ditches because daggone state never clean out the ditches. So that became a big issue. So I took all that dirt and I dumped it in the bottom because I was going to fill in all the ruts. Well, I never got around to it until probably November and then I did it and you know how the ground gets all muddy and all that crap around that time because all the rain and winter, snow and all that. Well, I ran through it a couple times after I filled in the ruts, and guess what? They came back. I seen mud. I got excited. So, I ripped and roared and got it all messed up again. This time, I'm thinking about placing all the leaves, the dirt, the rocks, somewhere out here in the center. Okay? So, we have like a little obstacle course that we can mess around with uh, the four-wheelers, golf cart, if I get back into the mud mower stuff, which I will this spring. I need to go get a mower so I can start building on it. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to stick it out here in the center somewhere. I still haven't decided, but I know it's not going to be around the trees. It's not going to be way down the ravine. It's going to be right up here. It's pretty easy to access if you get stuck or something like that. If you roll it, you don't want to roll into somebody else's property or into a tree or ruts and get smashed and all that crap. But, yeah. This is horrible right here. This is probably like two feet of leaves. And as you can see that dip right there that goes across the road. I'm pointing out to you right there. That's the culvert and the culvert's all clogged up. You should have seen the water rushing across the road. So that's what I'm doing today. So I'm gonna load up and get it going because we got a whole lot of crap to do. Take it out, but I'll figure it out.
thought. Um, as I said before, is when I first got stuck. As you can see, the bar has been bent out on both sides. Uh, this goes up, down, and then back up and over. So this will barely hook. Um, I'll pop that up and look at it in a second. Uh, if you look at the side, probably can't really see it. I'll get up under there and try to on the tripod. It's all blown out. Hope I got that on footage. Okay. This side. It's all blown out too. As you can see. Um, something is wrong with the, the tire. Looks like the plastic was... I can't tell if... I don't think it busted. It's not a, like a bearing. It might be some kind of plastic bearing, but that's what's in it. And you can see where it, it's got like a chunk of it. Where it's been going around like this, rubbing. Extremely bad. And inside the trailer over there. And over there. Oh my gosh, I didn't see that side. Holy crap, that's all pushed in. Oh man. I'll pull the door open in a second, but basically uh, the front end went down and got pulled that way. And from it doing that, it basically this side pushed up and that side pushed up and that's what busted the center up. Um, now if I didn't put these wooden sides on and put them together, who knows if the sides would have still been there by the time I got up here and washed it off. They could have completely just busted up. Hey, let's look at the tailgate. That's fixable. It's not bad. That's extremely bad. This is all busted. You can see what's going on. Let's pop it open. See, this was the strong part. This thing back here.